got home and they look so good i'm sure you guys can tell the difference but i am so pleasantly surprised because i remember last time i got a lash lift and tint it didn't really turn out that good but it looks like i'm wearing mascara like i'm probably not even gonna wear any while i'm out in montreal it looks so good i will say this eye looks better which is weird i feel like it's darker and a bit longer but maybe that's just the way my eyelashes are but i am really happy with the way that they turned out back in my room as you guys saw i just made my signature lunch which is my cilantro lime fish tacos also this is what i wore today i just have on my divinity flare jumpsuit with my zip up hoodie both from Maritzia this was just the quickest thing I could throw on and I haven't actually wore this out yet I've worn it around the house but it's really nice today so I decided to put it on I'm very happy my navigation package has arrived so you guys would have heard me talk about how I was waiting for this in my last vlog I was really hoping that it was going to arrive last night with my honor sports bra so I could wear it to my workout this morning but that didn't happen it's okay though rochelle wore hers to the gym today and they looked so good so i'm so excited about these i got them in an extra small and i'm thinking they'll fit perfectly but they're the contour seamless shorts i got gray and then i got orange like these look so good I'm definitely going to try them on after, but they literally go right up your butt. So it just makes your butt look so big. So I got the gray, like I said, 
and then I got the orange, which I am most excited about. Why did I do that? Which I'm most excited about. So yeah, it has the contours under to accentuate the booty. Yeah, I think this will fit perfectly in the waist. Let me try them on. Okay, here's the gray. So cute. They fit perfectly in the waist. No comment. <laughs> okay, here are the orange. These ones definitely fit a little bit smaller than the gray, which is weird because they're both the same size, but sometimes different colors have a different fit. I was picturing this with like a white sports bra. I think that'd be really cute. Okay, I've lined them up and you can actually see that the orange is a little bit smaller, which is super weird, but it is what it is. Hello, it is 3.30. A little bit later, I just put on a different outfit. I change so many times throughout the day. That's just in my nature. I've been like that forever. I just like wearing different things every time I leave the house. So here is my nail appointment outfit. So I have on this cropped garage sweater with my Aritzia flare straight leg sweatpants, my dunks, my princess poly bag, my cove clip, and yes, I am leaving the house with two star faces on. I don't care. <laughs> okay, I'm here and my appointment is at four. I'm a little bit early. I just left a little bit earlier than usual because I had to go to shoppers and drop off some Poshmark orders and need more deodorant. I am back on my Dove dry spray kick. I used to use this for years and then I switched over to a different um, aluminum free secret deodorant but it wasn't working as well and I really missed the spray one so I'm back on it. I haven't tried this scent though. It's calming ritual. Water lily and cherry blossom scent. That sounds like amazing so I'm very excited to try this. I think the scent I have now is like baby powder. I don't know. I really like that one, but I just wanted something different. But I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with my nails. I'm thinking I want to get a French tip and then on my ring finger get a little cherry. I saw someone on my Instagram do that and I thought it was adorable. I think I saved it. The Lucky Monday, Daniela posted it. Look how cute that is. So French tip and then just on the pink you get a little cherry. That's what I think that I want. I haven't had a white French tip yet in all of the appointments that I've had. I'm very excited. I have the blue right now. The last time that I went was, it was at the very beginning of April. I think it was, was it, it was after my birthday though. Two, two weeks ago. I thought it was longer than that. But anyways, I'm gonna get a fresh set for Montreal. I'm very excited. Okay, how cute. With the little cherry there. I think in the summer, maybe in a few months, I'll get the cherry on every finger. But for now, just the ring. It looks so cute. I'm obsessed. I went to Jenny. I normally go to Tina, but she was booked and I get a gel fill. So these are my real nails. There's just a hard gel on top. Okay guys, just got back from the mall with my mom. The whole reason I went is because I saw this butter yellow, like princess bell looking silk corset top at Aritzia when I was at Yorkdale and I should have tried it on but I couldn't stop thinking about it. And then I imagined an outfit with it for Montreal. And I thought it'd be really cute with that corset and my medium wash vintage low rise jeans and some sneakers. And I really wanted to wear that like with my leather jacket. I think that would be so cute, but they didn't have it at my local Aritzia. So I'm really sad, <laughs> but it's whatever. It wasn't meant to be. But I went into garage and I got a few tops. Naturally, I got a basic top in two different colors. So it's just this white button up tank top. I'm obsessed with it. I saw it on the mannequin. I was like, okay, this needs to be mine. I have a long sleeve version like this kind of from Aritzia that I love. And I was picturing wearing this. I'm gonna bring it to Montreal with some relaxed denim and my leather jacket just during the day for a super casual outfit because it is going to be nice out 
So I'm gonna wear like a tank top with a jacket. And then naturally I got it in black, like I said. Like, how cute. My bra's top is kind of see-through, like you can see my bra through it. So I don't really know what I'm supposed to do about that. I think I need to wear a darker bra, but you guys get the point. So freaking cute. I tried on a small and it was just like a little bit too loose. So I went with my true size, extra small. The black one looks good though. Okay, I put on a different bra and I think it looks a lot better. You can kind of see the straps here, but this was the vision with the low rise relaxed denim and some sneakers, maybe even a button up. Not sure what the weather is going to be like, but most likely a leather jacket. Anyway, I just felt like trying this on to uh, see if my vision came to life. But right now I need to do laundry like desperately. I have no socks. I haven't done whites in like a few weeks. So that is my main priority. And then I need to start planning and packing my outfits which will be fun. <laughs> I have like a rough idea of what I want to wear, but I need to actually try everything on and make sure that it looks good and works. Okay, I got all the whites in, but I'm also going to do my other laundry after just to be proactive and so I won't have to do laundry or be in need of laundry when I get home. I'm thinking smart here, but here are the options for tops. So for the weekend, I need a Friday day outfit, a Friday night outfit, a Saturday brunch outfit, Saturday day outfit, Saturday night outfit and then I think I can just repurpose everything that I brought into a Sunday outfit I'm not sure what we're doing Sunday we might just like go to a coffee shop or something but Sundays are a spa day so we don't really have anything planned I'm bringing this pink cardigan from Princess Polly for brunch I think that'd be super cute the only thing with this is I feel like wearing blue jeans with it is giving gender reveal so I don't know how I feel about that I would have to bring a separate pair of jeans to wear with these or maybe wear it with trousers I don't know like I said I'm gonna have to try some outfits on and then for going out outfits these are my options number one I really want to wear this because I've only wore it once to like a club but i love it so much and i really want to wear it again and i think this with my dickies would look so good again i think it would look weird with blue denim because it would give gender reveal with like the pink and blue so i think i would have to go with black pants for this so i'm gonna have to try on my dickies or a pair of black denim. I think my relaxed black would look so good good with this, but I don't want to bring so many pairs of jeans because like I don't want to overpack. But yeah, I'm definitely going to wear this one night. And then my other options for the next night are these three. I really wanted to wear this one that I got from Princess Polly but I'm leaning against it just because I'm gonna wear the other underwire one. So I don't wanna do two underwire outfits. Yeah, okay, so this one I'm not gonna wear. And then now I'm picking between these two. They're both like corset tops from Garage. I have a white linen one and then I have a black satin one, but I haven't wore this one, so I'm leaning towards this one. I think I could repurpose my low-rise denim with it and wear it like that because I've already wore this out a few times and I always wear white but I I like white <laughs> that's the thing maybe I'll bring both of these tops just so I have options here are denim options the thing is I don't want to bring too many my main priority right now 
is making sure the going out outfits look good so i need to try them on okay <laughs> this is definitely not it this is why i need to try things on before but i could bring these pants and wear them like with a t-shirt during the day just because if i'm wearing jeans out at night i probably won't want to wear them during the day but this is a no the only thing is i'm like okay is wearing dark pants with it too wintery like is it too dark or would it look good with light wash i just like don't like the pink and the blue i don't know i don't know i have tried on a few different things i tried on the low rise thrifted men's denim the black pair but i feel like because this top is so cropped it looked weird because there's so much space you know what i mean um whereas if i wore like a corset with it and it hit lower it would look better so i have to wear high-waisted denim i don't know maybe trousers but i don't think trousers is the vibe with this top but i could try okay i've tried on black trousers and i feel like it looks better i don't know though there's just something about the colors together that are giving me like a winter vibe i don't know if i'm being crazy so i don't know i think i'm gonna bring these pants to wear with it just because i don't want to wear denim two nights in a row you know what i mean i think it's cute and here is the other going out outfit that i'm gonna wear super basic but still really cute i feel like the low rise relaxed jeans make it a little bit more different than like if i was just to wear like regular high rise pants all right now i have to plan my day outfits so i think i'll come back to you guys with the final outfits here is the outfit lineup i don't want to overpack so i'm going to stay minimal as possible one thing i cannot forget is a bathing suit because we're going to the spa so i'm gonna put that in the pile after but firstly i have my first going out outfit which is the princess play top and the garage trousers and then i have the relaxed levi's and then i'm bringing both boosty like corset tops just because i'm not sure which one i'll want to wear but that's my other going out outfit and then i have these white jeans and this pink cardigan from princess polly for brunch i thought that was really cute and then here are all of my casual daytime pieces so i have um, just like a basic tank top from garage this will be really good that i can just like wear around the apartment too um, I have that button up that I showed you guys if I want like a more fun going out daytime look. And then I have this cream waffle knit from Brandy. I was picturing wearing that under this garage white button up, but I could also wear the basic one under. And then just a pair of high-waisted tight jeans. They're my Levi rib cages. And then I'll be wearing a sweat set there. And I can substitute any of those tops with the sweatpants. So... I think we're good. I'm very satisfied with everything. I just need to get like socks, underwear, bras, pajamas, but those are the going out outfits. So cute. <laughs> I had a quick bubble tea break with Rochelle, but I just finished packing everything into my weekender bag. I have my air forces under here and then i'm going to put my skincare right in there because i think it will fit perfectly and then i'm going to wear my dunks tomorrow and then i just have this tote here with my film camera and some liquid iv and i'm also going to throw my pillow in there but i'm going to end the vlog here so i can start editing this and i get it up for tomorrow I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog week. If you did, let me know in the comments and maybe I'll try to do one once a month or once every few months. But I love you and I'll see you in a few days with a new video.